Hello guys, welcome back to my channel Advanced Technology by Rana. In this training series, I am going to introduce Palo Alto Firewall 400 series and do the deployment of Palo Alto 460 model, which is the highest variant in 400 series firewall. Guys, Palo Alto 400 firewall is also a next generation firewall and designed for small offices and branch offices with 200 or 300 of staff. When I said I'm going to deploy Palo Alto 460 firewall, it's mean I'm doing deployment as in hardware instead of using any software or simulation tool such as GNS3, Cisco Packet Tracer or even G. The new Palo Alto 400 series firewall are ideal for organization who are in search of the lowest total cost of ownership with the best cybersecurity result. The Palo Alto 400 offer the same world-class security that their other appliances offer, but in form of small desktop form factor. This allow organization to extend zero network security to their most remote location and their small branches with the compact size in the deployment. Let's discuss some of the best feature of Palo Alto 400 series firewall and the first feature which is very amazing that it have a fanless cooling which means with no moving parts a fanless design significantly reduce the chances of failure second thing it have a dual power supply like the three variant from out of six variant have the dual power supply which means there is no more issue for the single point of failure another feature which is multiple mounting option desktop wall mount and rack mount allow palo alto 400 series the best choice for the deployment for their remote locations such as industrial location or their far end branches another thing the latest pan os 11.0 support is also there. This means you get all the features that were launched up to Pan OS 11, including credential phishing, prevention, and policy optimizer, uh, policy optimizer, uh, optimizer along with the new cloud entity engine feature. So these are the amazing features of Palo Alto 400 series firewall. The variant which are introduced, which is 410, 440. 445, 450, and 460. So guys, let's unpack the Palo Alto 460 firewall and see how it's look like. This is the box, same as Palo Alto firewall, but in a small shape. And the firewall is packed. The total weight of this firewall is around 2 kg. And this is the look for the Palo Alto firewall. Let me unwrap. So this is the very rushed look and it's something like industrial hardware and uh, it's a very strong body as compared to other Palo Alto uh, firewall model and there are total eight fast ethernet and gigabit support ports are available already there with the one management and console with the two usb uh, the sockets okay so this is the view of the palo alto firewall from the front and this is the top view and at the back side it have a support with the power two power supplies is there so this is guys the introduction of the palo alto 460 firewall now let's discuss about some of the feature with related to the, uh, the the technical specification of this firewall. Yes, guys, the Palo Alto 460 model have threat prevention throughput around 2.4 gigabit per second, and the IPsec VPN throughput is around 3 gigabit, and the maximum session which this model supported it is 400,000, and the new session per seconds are 73,000, which is quite good enough to support any remote branch or the staff with 200 or 300 of users who have utilized their network security. 
another thing on the network feature it is also supported as layer 2 as a layer 3 or a virtual wire transport mode on the routing side it supported most of all the soft uh, the protocols like bgp with the graceful restart rip static routing ospf version 2 version 3 on the p uh, point to point it is also supported for the multicast pim mode as a igmp v1 v2 and v3 also supported with the sd wan and ipv6 support so this is the guys introduction of 460 firewall now in the next video we will do the mounting of this hardware and we see how it will compatible for the uh, for the mounting prospect thanks for watching and stay tuned